Have you ever thought what it would be like to be immortal? Check this out. Hi. I'm here today to bring you the most important tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly, then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, a video game exploring the treatment of women in Hollywood has set a new standard of sophistication. Immortality, the latest from game maker Sam Barlow and his studio Half Mermaid, is something that has never existed before, a video game that is also three feature-length films, wrapped around a mystery. The three films tell a story about filmmaking, about the price of art, and about Hollywood's exploitation of women. The question of what happened to Marissa is an irresistible mystery and you, the player, now have access to a full archive of clips, rushes and behind-the-scenes footage from her career. In a nutshell, immortality is open to interpretation, what you bring to the game, and your path through it, will leave you with a different set of answers. Ready to play? News Source, The Guardian, NASA's robotic device is Plug and Play. Innovators at the NASA Johnson Space Center JSC have developed a soft, wearable, robotic upper limb exoskeleton garment designed to actively control the shoulder and elbow, both positioning the limb in specific orientations and commanding the limb through desired motions. The invention was developed to provide effective upper extremity motor rehabilitation for patients with neurological impairments like traumatic brain injury, stroke. Due to its portable, battery-compatible design, NASA's garment allows for task-specific and intensive motor practice, an important part of rehabilitation for such patients, to be performed outside clinical environments including in the home. News Source, Technology NASA, far-fetched through its weight behind Web3. It previously stated that, in collaboration with Outlier Ventures, their Dream Assembly Base Camp Accelerator program would be entirely focused on Web3 fashion entrepreneurs. Farfetch announced the eight companies that will participate in the first 12 week camp. Out of 200 applicants Alter, Curie, Endverse, Meta.rs, Mintouge, Reblium, Sknups, and Wear NFT were selected. Farfetch was looking for founders that show next wave thinking in key areas of digital fashion and immersive experiences. Farfetch wanted companies ready to build further, not from scratch. News source Vogue Business, a better, smarter way to search. Klarna has released its Klarna Creator app, a platform that will provide new opportunities for retailers and influencers to work together to mobilize brand campaigns, measure sales, and track performance. The new upgrades on Klarna's US platform include a new search and discovery tool, a donations feature, and shoppable video content. Over 450,000 retailers operate through Klarna's app to access its global consumer base of over 150 million customers. News source, Klarna, Mexico's Metaverse Mall is open. The island shopping mall features products from Victoria's Secret, Bath Body Works, and dozens of other well-known brands. The mall's developer has formed partnerships with Adidas, Nike, Puma, Levi's, and Apple. The Metaverse Mall is divided into sections. Users can explore emerging brands, host private events or socialize with other shoppers. Early adopters can earn prices like coins or score discounts thanks to a partnership with the UK-based company The Savings Group Limited. News source, CoinSpeaker, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week, Check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.